Investigative reversing three. We've recovered a binary in an image. See what you can make of it. There should be a flag somewhere. It's also found here on the shell server. Okay, well, I've gone ahead and I've downloaded this thing into Ghidra. So we'll take a look at it. Uh, we open the flag, we open the original, we open the encoder. This is looking a lot like investigative re uh, reversing two. And let's see, our offset is this 2D3. And, oh wait, while local 78 is less, yeah, it's not our offset. Um, local 10 is in F set offset, it's 28. Let's see what's going on here. So while we do that, oh, I see. So until we get to 2D3, we just copy the character. So that is going to be our offset. And then after that, we have another loop. If we're even, we code the character. And if we're odd, we just copy the character. OK. So we do two D three bytes, and then we do encode, not encode. All right, well, let's um, go back to our Python we had before. So I'm going to go to two D three. How long do we think this flag is? It's going to be 50 again because we're counting up to 100. Um, all right, so this does the binary. And we'll just, I guess, read another character because we don't care about writing them. We'll need to change the problem folder to a new one. So here's the new problem folder. Okay, can it really be that easy? So we went to the offset. We're going to do a binary. Um, Oh yeah, before we had this plus five, do we have a plus five anymore? I guess we need to look at coded character. Yeah, I don't see any plus five anymore. Sorry, that's just coding it. Here was the loop we cared about. Yeah. All right, so we'll get rid of that. looks so easy. All right, Pico CTF, another LSB problem. And there we go.